We're good. We have some. Yeah. All right. We're good.
I just wanted to make sure that, it, like, I'm going to leave now. I just wanted to make sure that uh, you have a good view and that's it. Fine. Thanks. Bonsoir, chers Félicien et Félicien de la promotion 2017. Bonsoir, chers parents, collègues, Madame Maretta et Madame Bourdieu. Nous aimerions souhaiter la bienvenue à nos invités d'honneur qui ont pris le temps de venir célébrer avec nous ce soir. Madame Donna Manos, ex-directrice de l'école Honorie Mercier. Monsieur Frank Marillo, ex-directeur et commissaire de l'école Honorie Mercier. Monsieur Marc Saracino, président du conseil d'établissement de l'école. Et finalement, Madame Patricia Latanzio, commissaire représentante de notre école, que j'invite sur scène pour vous dire quelques mots. Let me begin by welcoming all of you to today's graduation. Today is a special day for the graduates, for their proud parents, grandparents, family members, and their teachers. Today is also one of those great opportunities when we get to celebrate our young people, their achievements, their efforts, perseverance, as well as their successes. It gives us a chance to think back and feel good as a parent and or mentor knowing that you're, the kids that you care about are doing just fine and are on the right path. Graduates, you should know that your moms and dads and grandparents are very proud of you today. They have high hopes for you and they believe in you. Take a look at them now and you can see them smiling and snapping photos so that they can record this moment forever. Today is an important day both for you and for them. Today is also a day to thank them for supporting you, because as much as this is your achievement, this is also the achievement of the people who care about you. That means your mom, your dad, your grandparents, your sisters and brothers, your teachers, your daycare monitors, vice principal and principal, and all the other people who care about you. They want you to be your best, to live your life up to your potential. Grads, I'm gonna ask you to stand up. I'm gonna ask you to turn around and give them a round of applause. So thank you. You may sit down. Class of 2017. Graduations can be seen as a coming of age, a sort of official way to recognize when a person steps into the next stage of life. In graduates, you are stepping into that new stage of your lives. Do not be afraid, for I ask you to trust me in taking every chance you have in dedicating yourselves to making the next year of your lives even better. Remember that you do not have to follow the crowd, but rather be your own unique self. And I'm going to share with you a mantra that I live by and I've shared with my three kids ever since they've been young. And it goes like this. Do not go where the path leads you, but go instead where there is no path and leave a trail. 
Do the right thing, graduates, even if no one is looking. Study hard and remember that you're investing in yourselves with every exam that you take, every book that you read, and every assignment you hand in. The future is yours and seize every opportunity without, without hesitation or fear. So congratulations to each of the 2017 graduates, their parents and grandparents. Un caloroso uh, ringraziamento a voi genitori e nonni che lo so che voi siete sempre presso dei vostri figli e nipoti, dunque un ringraziamento anche, anche per voi and family members. And as your school board commissioner, a special thank you to the teachers, school staff, and everyone present here this evening and not present who has helped each one of our graduates step up, up onto the podium this evening. So thank you, enjoy your evening. Good evening and welcome to all parents, <coughs> staff members, and most importantly, Honorary Mercy Grade 6 students. We are honored to celebrate this day with you. Tonight is an opportunity to celebrate and reflect on the many years that students have contributed to our school, while also celebrating the opportunities that they will have as they move on to the next phase of their educational career. This is obviously an important night for the students, families, and the school. When you leave this building today, continue to follow your dreams. Continue to care about all those around you and live life full of passion. I know you will create something and be great, and I wish you all the best. Thank you. Bonsoir, Miss Miranda, Madame Karine et moi-même, Madame Lisa, sommes les enseignantes de la sixième année. Et nous sommes honorés d'être pour maître de cérémonie pour cette belle soirée. Nous aimerions remercier toutes les familles ainsi que tout le personnel présent ici ce soir. Vous avez tous joué un rôle très important dans l'éducation de nos finissants, de nos jeunes finissants. It takes a village to raise a child. And at our school, we take these words to heart and truly live by them. Thank you all for bringing our graduates to where they stand today. Tonight, we're celebrating our 63 graduates. In order to enjoy this evening, we ask that you follow a few simple rules. Please turn off all cell phones so that the ceremony can run without interruptions. Our photographer will be taking pictures of each graduate as they come up on stage to receive their certificate. We ask that you remain seated at this time so he can do his job efficiently. In order to allow our ceremony to run smoothly, we ask that you applaud only when all graduates have received their certificates. At the end of the ceremony, our grade five hosts and hostesses will be distributing the graduation program. Please remember to pick one up on your way out. And now, please join me in welcoming Mrs. Morada and Ms. Bogus, who will address our graduates. Good evening. Good evening, honored guests, parents, staff members, teachers, and naturally, our graduates. I would like to begin by thanking you all for welcoming me into your community. It has been an honor to serve this beautiful family. To my graduates and their teachers, thank you for contributing to my growth as a pedagogue. I congratulate you on your hard work, perseverance, and innovative accomplishments. I imagine you are excited to graduate, a little anxious about starting high school, sad to say goodbye to friends and teachers, and naturally looking forward to your summer holiday. 
we are too. <laughs> I want to wish you the very best as you embark on your new and wonderful journey. Remember to embrace growth. The next few years will determine your future. Find out what you're good at and what you love. Never give up. And when you fall, come back stronger. Don't forget your HM roots. Be generous. If you give more, you will receive more. It is better to give than to receive, as the old saying goes. Gratitude. Always be grateful. Say thank you. When we appreciate the people around us and the little things in life, the universe sends us more. Take this opportunity to thank your parents and family who have watched you grow with incredible dedication and love. Lastly, I want to thank you for making, part of, for making me part of your special day. It has been a privilege this year to be your principal. I'm so proud of all of you. Auguri ragazzi. Felicitations. Congratulations. Mesdames et Messieurs, sans plus tarder, j'inviterai Peter Francis Campisi à vous dire quelques mots. Good evening, everyone. I am both proud and humbled to be here tonight to welcome you to the Honor University of Grade 6 graduation ceremony. We are here tonight to celebrate the end of grade school and the beginning of a new chapter in our lives as we will soon start high school. We will leave behind fond memories such as the anticipation of Mr. George's annual concerts, Ski Week, Quebec City, Fun in the Sun, and Kinderfest. We will always cherish this year's, uh, what memories? We will miss our teachers at Honor Mercy, for they have not only taught us French, English, math, uh, but also many life skills. They taught us independence, confidence, respect, sharing and reaching out to others. These tools will serve us well throughout our lives. On behalf of our graduating class, we would like to thank our parents, grandparents, and classmates for their friendship, love, and support throughout the years. You have all contributed to making us who we are today. I'll leave you with this thought. Dream big, work hard, stay focused, and surround yourself with good people. Thank you. Start with Adamo Azvolo. It's the first one, we'll figure it out. Ivana 
Gabriele più no? Matteo Brajon? Massimo Bontempo? Raffaele Calabrese? Francis Cambisi, okay. Kayla Cancilla, Gabriel Caponi. Anika Cooper, <laughs> Sophia Krishi, Gianluca D'Amico. De Michele, Adriana Di Diego, Leila Di Marzio. Daniela Di Stefano, <coughs> Cecilia Do, Anthony Esposito. Maximus Fata, Lisa Marie Fazio, Karina Ferrante. Melissa Gallardo Castro. <coughs> Alessio Guidone. <coughs> Emilia G. Sarah 
Mara Yani. Michael Lombardi. Guy Lorenzo. Olivia Macri. Santo Marmonio. Vincenzo Missione Giordano Mureca Alejandro Nubaria. Sandy Pacheco Berube. Isabella Palota. Chiara Paulito. Joseph Anthony Petiti. Vanessa Pietrangelo. Jonathan Pomaski. Adrian Barello. <laughs> Julian Barello. <laughs> Claudia Quattrocho.
Simona Ranieri Thompson. Gianluca Ritoni. Alessandro Ruffalo. Alessa <laughs> Salvaggio. Cristiano Spadafora. Michaela Chilinguirian. <laughs> Adamo Timeo. Nicholas Palianti. Elizabeth Vasilakis. <coughs> Victoria Vitulano. <coughs> Anthony Zambito. Before we start, we would like to thank all our teachers and fellow graduates for giving us some of the best and most memorable moments over the past years. We will now reminisce with you some very special moments that we shared together throughout our years at Honor Mercy Elementary School. Let's begin. Je crois que la plupart de vous se rappellent du Kinderfest en maternelle. Nous avons eu beaucoup de plaisir à jouer avec nos amis et nos parents. Aussi, je me rappelle avoir couru autour de l'école pour trouver le bonhomme de pain d'épices. Après ce défi, nous avons cuisiné nos propres biscuits et nous en étions très fiers. Je suis certaine que la plupart de nous se rappellent de la première année, surtout quand nous sommes allés à l'internet voir les abeilles. C'était une des premières sorties que nous avons faites. Now on to second grade. I am sure we all remember how we dunked our teachers in the water at fun in the sun. We were all chanting and cheering each other on, hoping to hit the target so the teacher would fall in the water. 
Fun in the Sun was a memorable moment for all of us. By the way, don't forget your gym clothes tomorrow. It's fun in the sun. <laughs> Yay, we're finally upstairs now. We're with the big kids now. In grade three, a lot of new things happened. We had our first hill run. I am sure we will all remember that feeling of accomplishment when you finish the race. We had great times, but now we are, we are already moving on to grade four. En quatrième année, nous sommes tous devenus des architectes. Nous avons construit des maquettes qui représentaient la Nouvelle-France. On travaillait très fort et quand on a fini de construire la maquette, nous étions encore une fois très fiers de nous. Et au suivant, il est l'un des plus gros projets que nous avons fait en cinquième année. Nous avons appris qu'il faut toujours aider les personnes dans le besoin. Nous avons également appris beaucoup sur la méthodologie grecque. De plus, je me souviens quand j'ai reçu la fille qui me demandait l'autorisation pour aller au campagne. C'était la première sortie où nous sommes restés pendant une nuit. Nous nous sommes vraiment amusés à faire des jeux et des activités dans la forêt avec nos amis. This leads us to grade 6, our last year at Honor Mercy. I'm sure you will all agree with us when we say it has been a great year. We got to do so many amazing and memorable things, such as going to ski week. We all started off on the bunny hill, and before we knew it, we were ready for the big hills, which meant getting on and off the chairlift, or at least trying to. During that week away from our families, we learned how to ski and how to be a little more independent and grown up. We were also daring enough to try something other than Nana's pasta, which by the way, we did miss dearly. We thank our teachers for taking the time to be with us and for making it a trip that we will be talking about for many years to come. Québec était notre dernière sortie comme finissant. Ce fut deux jours merveilleux avec nos amis et super propres. On a vu beaucoup de choses intéressantes sur cette magnifique ville, ainsi que sur l'histoire de notre belle province. Nous allons toujours se, sou se souvenir de la fameuse poutine chez Ashton. We hope you have enjoyed your little trip down on your mercy in Mary Lane. After seven years of memorable moments, we are not only here to celebrate our past, but also everything that awaits for us in the future. The following message from Mother Teresa is something we've heard since kindergarten, and we feel it's a positive message we can all carry with us the rest of our lives. Not all of us can do great things, but we can all do small things with great love. As we begin this new journey, may we all do our part in making this, this world a better, kinder, and safer place. Thank you. Accueillons maintenant Miss Murata et Miss Vogues qui présenteront les prix spéciaux. I would like to invite the level five teachers to present this year's award for English. Level five teachers. <laughs> the English award is awarded to Maximus Fata and Adriana Vivieri. Level four teachers to present this year's award for Francais. <laughs> Awarded to 
Anika Cooper. I would like to invite the level three teachers to present this year's award for math. <laughs> Awarded to Chara Paulito and Vanessa Piedrante. I would like to invite the level two teachers to present this year's award for Science et Technologie. Awarded to Raffaele Calabrese. I would like to invite the level one teachers to present this year's award for Univers Social. You're all trying to guess who it is. Oh yeah, hi Awarded to Alessandro Ruffolo. Awarded to Joseph Anthony <coughs> Petiti. I would like to invite Mr. Nick, Ms. Franca, and Mr. Matthew to present this year's award for art. <laughs> Awarded to Isabella Palo. <laughs> Awarded to Sonia Moran, <laughs> Anthony Esposito, and Anthony Zambico.
I would like to invite Mr. George to present our music award. And congratulations, Mr. George, for your award. And the award goes to, drum roll please, Fabrizio Nini. italiano di Pena. Una classe speciale con tanti ragazzi di carattere diverso, però uniti con la stessa voglia di imparare la nostra bella lingua italiana. E ne approfitto per ringraziare i genitori e i nonni che li hanno sempre incoraggiati e spinti a frequentare il corso Pena. Oggi è il vostro giorno speciale e vi auguro un avvenire piena di tanto successo, di tanto amore e di tanta salute. Allora, buon proseguimento nei vostri studi, buona serata, ancora auguri e buona vita a tutti. Bravo. Allora, il ragazzo, il ragazzo che è stato premiato, tutti erano bravi però bisognava sceglierne uno, e Kyle Lawrence. <laughs> Kyle is also featured in our Italian uh, podcast. So. <laughs> gives us a brief history on Café Milano. <laughs> That's coffee and tell. I would like to invite Ms. Dimitra to present this year's award for the Playground Leadership Program. <laughs> Good evening. Good evening, parents, uh, colleagues, and uh, the awesome, amazing graduates. You're all... Thank you. Uh, I've been, I am very blessed to have been a part of this special school for the last 18 and a half years and to do, well, to run a program that I absolutely love dearly. Uh, I would like to take this opportunity to say thank you to the wonderful Army University staff, to uh, Ms. Daniela Butino, she was here, uh, and her team, the Home and School, and Ms. Rogis for the continued support, Ms. Morona, you came to Army University and immediately embraced your program and I thank you for that and uh, for your support throughout. Thank you. The Playground Leadership Program was developed with the intent of making a positive difference uh, in our playgrounds during children's playtime. It creates safe play in a structured but fun environment. Right? <laughs> Tell your parents. <laughs> Um, while it fosters leadership skills 
conflict resolution, and social development. The program would not be possible without playground leaders, grade five and six. <coughs> Students who are interested can participate. The role is to encourage, motivate, animate, and teach the younger students to play specific games. But most importantly, to be positive role models. The student who is receiving the Leadership Award this evening did just that. Her effort, her patience, and dedication is very much appreciated by all, especially the younger students. Please join me in congratulating Sophia Rose Laosha. <laughs> Ms. Manos to present this year's Jimmy Trevisono Humanitarian Award. Good evening. They say you can't go home again, but they're wrong. You can come home to honor Ringers yet. It's so nice to see you. Especially, I'm so excited to see the graduates of the class of 2017. Congratulations, felicitations. You're going on to high school next year. I can vouch, you're going to love it. Never give up your quest for knowledge. And at the end of the day, what's really important is how good a person you are and what you've done that day. I'm very honored <coughs> this year to present the Jimmy Trevisono Award. This award was established in Mr. Jimmy Trevisono's honor. Mr. T, as we fondly called him, was a teacher at Honoré Mercier for many, many years, most of his career, as a matter of fact. Unfortunately, soon after his retirement, he passed away. While he was a teacher at Honoré Mercier, Mr. T devoted every single moment of every day to his students. He was there to help each and every one of them and each and every boy and girl at Honoré Mercier. Many generations went through Mr. T's years at Honoré Mercier. Not only was he an excellent teacher. He was an excellent mentor to many other teachers and student teachers and to the students. He was one of the founding members of the Honoré Mercier annual ski trip, which I know the grade six students continue to enjoy. His pride and joy was his family and especially his family at Honoré Mercier. He embraced uh, everything that I can think of. He was a teacher of teachers, a mentor of mentors. He was kind. He was very patient. He always had a good word for everyone. He'd greet you in the morning. He was there early. He always was there to lend a helping hand. When this award was established, we wanted to honor him, to honor his legacy. And this student embraces very much what Mr. T was about. It's a student who's there to help. It's a student with a wonderful, bright spirit. It's a student that is ultimately what I think Honoré Mercier is truly all about. This award is 
Uh, we have a wonderful clock as soon as you enter the school, so the name will be inscribed on the clock, and then of course the award goes home with the student. So it is my honor to announce this year's winner of the Mr. Trevisono Award, Humanitarian Award. The award goes to Kayla Canchila. <laughs> Ms. Franca, Mr. Matthew, Ms. Naomi, and Madame Melanie to present this year's award for effort and perseverance. <laughs> the award goes to Gabriele Duno and Gabriel Capone. Mr. Joe Diviello and Mr. Mark Saracino to present this year's RPC Merit Award. The award goes to Simona Ranieri Thompson. <laughs> Invite our honored guests, Ms. Patricia Latanzio, Ms. Vocus is here, our level six teachers, and Mr. Verillo to present this year's P PSBGM Award, which is a scholarship award. The PSBGM Cultural Heritage Foundation is a nonprofit corporation established in May of 1980 under the Canada Corporations Act. The primary purpose of the foundation was to maintain and promote a collection of paintings donated to the foundation by the Protestant School Board of Greater Montreal. In 2013, the foundation undertook to sell the greater part of the collection with a view to establishing a scholarship fund for students of the EMSB. <clears throat> Scholarships are awarded to deserving students in all sectors of the EMSB. Elementary school recipients of the scholarship are awarded $100. The scholarships this year are awarded to Leila Di Marzio. Nana Yanni. Dana Pablata. <laughs> Emma Marzilli. <laughs> and Victoria Vitulano.
en remerciant Mme Patricia, qui est élève de 5e année, Luca Papadiondoufoulos, Luca Cognata, Emma Catalozzi et Megan Nicard qui nous ont aidés ce soir. Nous prenons aussi le temps de remercier tous les parents qui ont collaboré au comité des finissants et tous les professeurs qui se sont impliqués en nous accompagnant dans nos sorties tout au long de l'année. Un merci bien spécial à Mme Josie Esposito, présidente du comité des finissants, ainsi que tous les parents qui se sont impliqués de près ou de loin dans l'organisation des diverses activités pour nos finissants. Leurs heures passées à planifier, préparer et mettre sur pied les différents événements sont innombrables. Rien n'aurait été possible sans leur aide précieuse et leur dévouement. Nous avons la chance à honorer Mercier d'être entourés de parents impliqués dans l'éducation de leurs enfants et nous en sommes extrêmement reconnaissants. J'invite maintenant Mme Josie Esposito à venir vous dire quelques mots. face behind all those famous emails. I promise no more emails after tomorrow. Um, I would like to say a thank you to everyone that, uh, for their constant, constant support. The administration, the staff, Mr. Ms. Marada, Ms. Vogus, everyone, you were amazing. All you parents that always were there to help with the fundraising and stop everything at a moment's notice to come help. So we have a few uh, gifts to give. So I invite uh, Ms. Marana and Ms. Bogus, please. <coughs> this is also to say thank you for your constant support. Uh, Karen, Ms. Elisa, Ms. Morena. As far as I'm concerned, they're the best teachers ever. They were there constantly, and they're so amazing with our children. So thank you. George, Mr. Matthew, they were there to pick up the slack at every moment, to pick up luggages, backpacks, every moment they were always there, so I want to say a big thank you to that. and to Giulia Avanzato. They were there, they listened all the time, especially Paola Colapelli. And I would like to invite now the people, the volunteers that were there every single week for the TCBY. So, Paola, TCBY, they were there every single week in the gym to sell it, to distribute it. They were amazing. Paola Colapelli, Mario Catangelo, Mary Para, and Nadia, uh, just a really big thank you. It was such a headache. I stayed only a few times in the gym and I thought I was going to go crazy. And also, all the kids that help sell it every week. You're oh, and Julia! Julia!
I hope you guys are enjoying your party. Um, all your parents helped, really, really helped contribute to this. Thank you again to the staff to support your focus in Colorado. You're amazing. And have a good night. Thank you. <laughs>
Sadly though, as the saying goes, every good thing must come to an end. Which, which I guess is a good thing. Because without an end, there wouldn't be a new beginning. <coughs> and new beginnings, well, they can be a little scary at first. But they truly are quite exciting too. New beginnings mean new adventures, new challenges, and new friendships. New beginnings mean growing up, learning more about ourselves, and becoming more independent. So, as mixed as my feelings may be, I know that it's time for you to move on to bigger and better things. However, I'm not going to say goodbye because goodbyes are just too final. Instead, I say to you, until we meet again. Mes chers élèves, ce fut un énorme plaisir de vous enseigner cette année. Avoir eu la chance de vous côtoyer à tous les jours m'a permis de vous connaître très bien et de vous aimer encore plus. Ce qui rend votre départ beaucoup plus difficile. Je tiens à vous féliciter pour tout le travail que vous avez accompli. Je suis très fière des efforts et de la, de la persévérance que vous avez démontrés tout au long de l'année. Vous avez certainement prouvé que vous êtes prêts à comporter de nouveaux défis. Et j'ai confiance que vous allez tous réaliser de beaux projets dans votre avenir. C'est avec cette confiance et fierté, mais autant de tristesse, que je vous dis au revoir. I will miss each and every one of you. Your kindness towards one another. Your kindness towards one another and good sense of humor made our class a very happy place. And I'm thankful to have been a part of it. Thank you for the many, many laughs, the morning smiles, and sometimes grunts. <laughs> But most of all, thank you for making this past year an unforgettable one. To wrap things up, I would invite Peter Francis Campisi back up to the podium. Nous avons débuté notre aventure à Honoré Mégé il y a sept ans, sans même savoir attacher nos fruits. Nous nous sommes maintenant prêts pour la seconde année. Nous laissons plusieurs de nos bons amis commencer de nouvelles amitiés. Nous allons apprendre de nouvelles leçons de vie et rencontrer de différentes personnes. Mais nous n'allons jamais oublier tout ce qu'on a vécu et accompli avec l'aide de nos professeurs incroyables dans l'aide de marché. 
Félicitations, finissant de 2017. Ce soir, célébrons et amusons. begin a new chapter in their lives, yet sad to see them leave our community family. I hope that all your successful endeavors will have you reflect upon your positive experiences here at our university. Ms. Marad and I would like to share a lifelong lesson with you before you exit the gates of our university. The our university school success, loyalty, respect, pride, and honor, words to live by always. Success, together we can succeed. Simply stated, always do your best. Respect, respect your parents and your elders because they truly do know best and they are always there to guide you and support you. Remember that golden rule. Honor, there are no shortcuts to any place worth only. Honor yourself by working hard, hard being a good person and taking the honorable route together. Pride. Always be a first-rate version of yourself instead of a second-rate version of someone else. Be yourself, be proud of who you are and where you come from. It will help you to get where you want to go and run faster. Loyalty. You can't live a perfect day without doing something for someone who will never be able to pay you back. This is, that is the definition of a true leader. Okay. You're going to At this point, there, put this. I would like to ask the great six teachers to come up and present the valedictorian awards. Oh, that's such a good award. Peter Campisi. Gianluca D'Amico. <laughs> and Olivia Macri. I would like to thank Ms. Morata, Mrs. Latanzio, Mr. Sarancino, our honored guests, the fantastic Grade 6 team, all the Honor University staff, and the incredible Grade 6 Graduation Committee for making the 2017 graduation so memorable. Boys and girls, staff, and special guests, you are all invited to a special dinner and party. Um, farewell party, actually. Have a great time. And parents, please remember to pick them up at 10 15. <laughs> Réunissant de la promotion 2017 vont conclure cette belle cérémonie en vous chantant une chanson apprise de leur cours de musique. Un gros merci à M. George et M. Matthew pour avoir organisé le magnifique montage que vous allez voir à l'instant. Maintenant, place à nos finissants. George, you can't split the screen because it won't play up there. What? What are you talking about? You can't split the screen, it won't play. What are you talking about? So just unsplit it. What? No, sure. Yeah, yeah, it won't play it in full screen. Sure, well. No, it doesn't. What are you talking about? I just played it. Look. No, you won't hear it. Yeah? And look, it won't go up there. See? 
Yeah. I did I did it before though. I had it before. There you go. Here. Then yeah, you move your mouse you move your mouse here. Oh, no, no. It's gonna stop. Oh. Then what's hold on. Oh, the other projector. Somebody moved it. Hold on. Yeah, we're good. Can you put it to begin? <coughs> Am I standing? I stand here? Like this is good? I have to stand up. Yeah. Keep 